What is happening to you? This is spirit on your shoulder. <laughs> this is spirit on your shoulder. What is happening here? What is happening here? Yeah. Why are you closing his eyes, this man? <coughs> huh? Huh? <coughs> you don't want him to see vision. You want him to be like you? You are, you are closing his eyes? Yes. Come here. This, this lady. Can you move there? Move there. Move there. Move there. Move there. Move there. Can you just come? Move. <coughs> yes, come. Come on, come on, come on, bring her, bring this lady here to me. You must forgive yourself on someone who disappointed you. Okay. Because you always blame yourself for no reason. Eh? Yes. Uh, just forgive yourself, forgive the person who hurt you. Because I heard that someone hurt your heart. So allow you okay. to be the past. God will start to bless you. Okay. You hear me, my sister? Okay. Yeah. Uh, can you come here? Can you touch him? Where's your mom? Is it? Yes. You must listen to your mom. The, she's not listening to you. It's not true, mama. Yes. Huh? Yes. She doesn't listen to you, this lady. Yes. Huh? Yes. You must listen to your mom. Okay. Huh? Why you put these things here? Mama doesn't want this thing. Why you put them? You know, you know them. Huh? She's my niece, huh? and she knows that I don't like these things. You also, you don't want them. No. So I why you put this thing when you know your mom doesn't want this? Look, look what is happening here. Look what is happening. Why you put these things? Um, I didn't tell her when I went to, huh? I didn't tell her when I went to do them. You didn't tell them? No. Uh, Mama, let's remove these things today. Yes. Huh? Yes. So you are worried that this girl is becoming like this, becoming a wayward child. Huh? Yes. Yeah, you, your friends are taking you away. You've got wrong friends. Huh? Amen. Can you remove this thing now? Now? Yes. Remove this thing now. Remove this thing. They don't even make you a very beautiful girl. Now get a knife. Cut the nose. <laughs> can you get a knife, Mama? <laughs> no, you are, how can you? Eh? She's got another one here. Can you just the believe neighbor. that? They say they've got another one here. Can you just believe this? Yeah, Mama, she's worried. Your sisters? We are your sisters, yes. Your sisters? We are. She knows that I don't like these things. I've been saying this to her. You love these ones? Yes. You love those things? That no, you no. Mama, I told her about these things here. Yeah. Why are you doing these things that you have never seen in your family? Look here, look at your elder sister there. You people, you, you, are, you are putting a spirit of failing to marry on you. And these people are praying for you that what, that it has not happened to them, it must not happen to you. Eh? It's true what I'm saying. That's true, Apostle, that's true. And now you are applying these things to yourself. Remove these things now. Mama, help her. You, you can just pull it like this. <laughs> so that she must not put this thing again. By doing this, we are setting this girl free. This girl, is, she doesn't listen to anybody. Eh? She doesn't. Eh? She doesn't. I just keep quiet. I don't talk to her anymore. You don't talk with her anymore? I don't. I'm very strict, Pastor. Can we I... give glory to Jesus? Yeah. From today, we, we need to forgive this girl. You need to forgive this girl. Amen. Uh, we need to forgive this girl. What is happening with your things? Take them out. I have to go back. To where you put them? Yes. Where did you put them? In Pretoria. Because I was seeing that you will put something here. From there you are going to put something here. 
everywhere. Yes. She was saying she wants to put them. She said she wants to put something here. I was saying that she's going to put things here. From there she started to be these people who are selling the body because of a, the beauty. You call them what? You call them queens, queens. <laughs> yes. I was saying that I was saying that this girl will end up being a, a queen, queen. You understand? Yes. You, you were going on the road of being a slave queen. You, I want to see you next week with your mom, with your sister, without these things. You understand? If not, you won't live long. God bless you. Greetings in the name of Jesus. My name is Rose Bushomani. I'm from Rodiport. Next to me is my daughter, Nelly Bushomani, from Rodiport. The other one is my sister, Habib Bushomani, from Rodiport. Yes. I'm here to confirm the prophecy that uh, the man of God prophesied over my daughter's life, saying that she has piercing on her nose, so she must remove all those piercing on her nose so that she can be free from the the spirit. Oh yes, uh, my name is Habib Bushamani, as she has already introduced me. I'm um, Nelly's aunt, and yes, indeed, it is true that um, she has the piercing and somewhere on her body as well. And I've been talking to her about this piercing, but um, it's been a while, I think, if I'm not mistaken, from last year. And even, I think, two weeks ago, I told her that I didn't like the other piercing somewhere else. But I just want to thank God that, listen, um, she has heard it from the man of God today. And I think she will, um, she will really get rid of all these things. And I thank you for her deliverance. And she will also help other, you know, other girls out there just to let them know that these things can just get really get them into trouble. I just want to thank God for remembering my family today. We have a lot that we are dealing with in my family, the family spirits and everything. And I just want to thank God that he has located us through the men of God today. In Jesus' mighty name, amen.